let's actually come to this next project idea that I have that I think is pretty big, very interesting, especially for you guys. <laughs> Good morning signers, welcome to today's episode. I got here a nice new interesting package. Please don't look over there, it's a little messy. I also got extremely good news today. I reached a chart position in the Spanish dance charts 81, which is already pretty high, pretty good. All of that with my fall track that you guys are able to remix or were able to remix. You just got two more days to upload it. Don't forget it, otherwise you won't take part in it. There are extremely cool prizes available by Arturia, by F Expansion, by FabFilter and Splice. So please make sure to send your track and also go there, check out everyone else's track and leave a vote and like for the other producers. Another thing that makes me extremely happy is, as you know, I had financial problems, mainly because of my management screwing up entirely and, and still not really paying me my, my money that my tracks made on their label. Today is the first day my bank account is again in the plus. No more rent, no more debt, no more interest to the bank. That's all gone. I have to be careful with that very fragile, fra fragile, fragile. I don't know. It's one of these English words that I know how to write. I know how to read it. I know what it means, but I actually never said it before. I think it's French or rooted in French. I don't know. But as it always plays out in, in life, <laughs> the second you have money, it's already gone again. I today got the invoice for the car that we ordered. Luckily, I don't have to pay it at once because <sighs> the amount is yeah, breathtaking. Hi. But yeah, you only live once. So let's get to this right here. Oh, it's so nice and furry. It's actually a uh, dead cat. <laughs> yeah, funny, huh? But yes, if you're wondering what this is for, of course, for the vlog microphone. Again, thanks a lot to Apijit for sending it to me. It's, it's amazing. I also played around a little bit with the EQ settings on the vlog. So without the EQing and compression, it sounds like this. Pretty simple little volume. And with the EQing and compression, you just have a little bit more, more punch in the voice. And this right here is of course to put it on top of the mic and instead of having in the microphone, it will be just, I hope there is a difference. Now it's time to head to the studio and test out this furry thing. It's the perfect day to test it. It's windy, stormy, dark and cold. Nah, it's actually one of those rare, nice German days. Perfect weather. And since my mic now got a fur, it's time to actually get rid of my own and defure through my hair. Getting a haircut. Yes, guys, I got the full barber treatment. Looks really good. And this is all for the red carpet tomorrow at the video days. I got invited amongst 300 other social media superstars to participate. I honestly don't know why they invited me. There was no red carpet and the invitation just said food and drinks. And that's why I'm going. I mean, you, you know me. It will all just probably be a whole lot of fun. I also got invited to something else in Berlin in two or three weeks, which will also be really exciting, but more on that in a couple of days. Also another quick update, the, the accents guys, the two that didn't really respond for the releases and everything, they got back to me luckily, all good, all fine again. They're working on new tracks for accents, so everything cool. I'm extremely happy about this because they're so talented producers. I, I just love having them on board being part of my label. But yeah, enough with the updates now, straight back to the We Run and Track, working on it, trying to finish it, because tomorrow I can't be here in the studio, I'm at the video days, and the day after that is actually the second day of the video days, but I'm not sure if I will go there, might be just a big waste of time, really depends on how the first day goes. And I actually got the next big project that I'm working on, that I'm planning, but more on that, after I've finished the work on the new track. Yeah. 
all done with work, all done with making music, all done with checking out your demos. I got a track by one person that is extremely good. I will get in touch with him. I will try to get him to be part of the Accents Crew releases track on my label. If you're also interested to release your tracks, there is a link down below in the description, the demo submission link thing, just send it there. I will listen to every single submission and also let you know that I listened to it. I unfortunately can't get back to you in person anymore. I'm just sending you out a confirmation that I've listened to it. I wish I had the time to give everyone feedback, but that's really just not possible anymore. If you're interested in feedback, you can send it to the track submits. I will pick every week or two weeks, three to five tracks that I will listen to and give feedback here in one of the videos. If you want a personal direct feedback guaranteed, you will have to become a patron. All of the information is also down below in the description. As you might remember a couple of videos ago, I told you that I have now a little bit more time again since I got used to doing the releases for my label that I can actually start the next project and the next project will actually be another segment. We have already the track submits, the hangover story time, we have the Q&As and the next one will be called probably EDM Legends. I'm absolutely not sure about the name so if you have any suggestions let me know in the comments. This segment will be me visiting, hanging out, interviewing, doing a small little tutorial with big EDM stars. People that really achieved something, people that are touring the world, that produce for big labels and that you probably all know or at least know their music. As you might remember I've been ghost producing like two years ago for the last time for other bigger DJs. I sometimes still hang out with them, usually late at night in clubs, drinking gin and this kind of stuff, but I actually never show them in the videos so that no one knows I can't share this information with you. But because of that I have caught contact to actually quite big labels, quite big interesting DJs and producers and I will invite them or go and visit them at least like I will try to do it once a month or every two months. It really depends on how much time I have because these videos will take up quite a lot of time to make and to organize especially finding a date with these kind of DJs isn't easy and I will do this 100% only with people that are real producers so all of the people that I've ghost produced for will never ever be in this segment. Even if I wanted I can't for legal issues and it doesn't make sense to have someone talking about music production that doesn't know anything about music production. This goes out to Alan Walker but psh. So I hope you like this idea. Let me know what you think about it. Let me know what you want to know from these persons that really achieved something big that we probably all admire or want to be like them or have the success they have. And also, as I said, a name for it would be cool. I think EDM Legends is, is, is a nice name, but maybe you have a better idea and also an idea for like an intro because I already have an intro for the Q&A, track submits, hangover story time, and I want to make one for, for those interview tutorial kind of things but yeah that's it from the studio now walking down the stairs telling you as always that i'm extremely late extremely extremely late today it's already past eight i even had to go back film this entire last section again because i forgot to turn on the microphone so even later than usually a lot later oh god the day just needs more hours. Honestly, the day just needs more than just 24 hours, maybe 26, 30. That would be really great and solve a lot of my problems. Or maybe just having this superpower to freeze the time. That would be cool. I think there was like a TV show back in the 90s with a girl that could do that. I just love that. Also, let me know what superpower you would like to have. And speaking of freezing the time, let's now speed the time up to just save your time. See, that's basically how you turn 10 minutes into 10 seconds. I need that just the other way around. You know how I started the vlog here with, with the new mic, the car finally getting back to zero with my bank account. Just got an invoice over almost 500 euros for the dentist. So, yeah. The day is getting better. Pasta, parmesan, not as much as I would love to have. Vanessa is also here, finally. How do you like my haircut? Good? Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. And how do you like the haircut of my mic? Very nice. It's now a hairy penis. 
It's again one of those past midnight sessions because there is actually one more thing. There is one more thing. Rest in peace, Steve Jobs. And to find out what the other project is, there is a link in the description. The first one, it will lead you to a Google form because for this project, I need your help, a little bit of information to make it right. And by filling out that form, you will also find out what the project is. I think it's just the next natural step, something a lot of you have been asking for. And among everyone that is filling out this form, if you leave your email address, I will pick 10 for the John Syme team app. And that's already it for today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell thing. Um, yeah, and I think that's already it. Tomorrow, video days. I don't know what to expect. If they have free boosts, it will be a whole lot of fun. If not, we will see. <laughs> Dead rat. It's called that cat. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. That rat? Pretty close. If you didn't hear that, really I good. Didn't know. You want to cuddle with it? No. I'm gonna hold on to you with two hands.